but it's unlisted, so no one can see it yet. I always do this to start with. So that gives me yeah. time to set up all the details, and once the details are done, then I will go live. However, if anyone watches the stream after it's over, it will start now. So now, from now on, I am Raven, okay? Raven, Raven, Raven. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Uh, do you want me to go ahead and click on the uh, screen share thingy? Uh, give me a second to finish setting all this up, and then I will. <clears throat> okay. Because i got to make I sure that... I've been... Yeah, go ahead. I was saying I've got to make sure that everything's running correctly. Okay, that's fine. I've been doing pretty good uh, doing that with whenever whenever I'm talking to tech or someone else from the server. I've been pretty good calling you guys either Raven or Lark. Yep, as long as as long as you're a member. Ah, perfect. That'll do. <coughs> That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Well, I was setting up, and yeah, that <laughs> looks. Gracie's being a fat cat again. Can you hear her? Yeah, I heard her. Yep, there she is again. Hi, baby. You poor baby. She just wants to make noise. <clears throat> well, she's a cat. She thinks she has a voice. She doesn't. <sighs> she does. She lets me know every day. She yells at me in the morning. Hey, hey, where's my food? Hey, listen. Hey, 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 listen. Yeah? Yeah. There it goes. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. She likes to back talk too. Is that right, Gracie? Yeah, you do. You like to back talk. Because that's just how you are. Okay, save that. <clears throat> Alright, uh, now that that's done, let's go ahead and switch to share screens. Oh, hold on. Okay, go ahead and do the share screen. All right. Send request. Uh, waiting on it. Oh, I gotta go here. Hold on. Yeah, this should okay. do it. Okay. That's uh, it. It's like, don't you dare tell me it's broken again. That should do it. Yeah, okay. It's loading. There it goes. Okay. Sorry. Can you see everything? Yes, I can see everything. Okay, good. Um, now let me switch back over and I'll start the stream. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad. Okay. It seems to be working. I just got to set the stream to live now. <clears throat> okay. We'll see if this works. We haven't done this in a long time. Yeah. All right. Now let me pull it up on my tablet so that way I can read chat as we go. If you want to read any chat stuff, you're free to. I I don't think Havoc will be joining us because if you, when Havoc plays, he usually starts like, like at 6 my time. Um, cause his time is different, obviously. He's four hours ahead. So if he hasn't yeah. started now, I don't think he's going to. It's just fine. It's not a problem. Yeah. It's just everyone was saying like, oh, Havoc is gonna stream tonight. And I was like, oh. <laughs> like he is? No. <laughs> it's fine. All right. Sending the text to Daniel so that he knows. Oh, let me add to the title. Let me add this to the title. Let me add this real quick. Okay. Also, it's like you're lagging really bad. Uh, hey, Hannah, your your um, your your audio sounds really bad. Yeah, you're you're lagging pretty bad. Uh, try again. Can you hear me? Yeah, there we go. Now it sounds better. Now okay, it sounds. Yeah, you sound. Yeah, you sound better too. Now it, it went weird again. I don't know what's going on. That's weird. That is odd. Maybe it'll sort itself out. Okay. Yeah, it sounds good now. It's, it's weird. Hello, folks! Ah. All right. Let's not waste any time and get right into it. Because we're making up for last night. Uh, let's see. What have we got? What have we got? What have we got? I know I've got a... Oh, i got to do Attacker, Strong Slayer, and Storied. Well, guys, got a little bit of a treat tonight. Um, 
tonight. Uh, yeah, y'all noticed the pirate theme. Yeah, there's no real reason for it. I just, uh, I just wanted to do that. <laughs> I kind of wanted to, uh, do a pirate thing. Um, because I was watching Muppet Treasure Island earlier and it's, it was fun. But tonight is a little special. Uh, we've got Hannah with us tonight. Hannah's actually live with us tonight. So say hello, Hannah. Hello, Hannah. Ah, you can do better than that. <laughs> nah. Nah. Well, hopefully, hopefully your uh, audio stays good throughout the whole thing because it kind of gets choppy here and there. <clears throat> yeah, let, let's hope so, yeah. If not, we may need to restart the party just to see what happens. Yeah. That would suck. That would suck. You know who we blame that on? Who? Gracie. Yeah, we can blame Gracie for it. Aaron Cuban won't attend. It's his beat. -out. Okay, well, happy birthday, Cuban, and he can join next time. You playing with friends tonight? Uh, we'll see. We'll see. I'm not sure, um, because I'm already stressing uh, everything to the limit by doing this while doing a party with Hannah. Uh, so we'll see what happens. Let's get into a match first, and then we'll see how things hold up. Let's play Varingian to start off, because we got to play a heavy anyway. Hey, Goo, how you doing? Play Warden first? Uh, got, got to play a heavy, otherwise I would. I'll play a Warden at some point tonight. Oh, look at that. Frisky, frisky, tiny, tiny. Yeah, Gracie's coming by to bother you, is she, Hannah? No, I mean, not yet. Let me see. No. Not yet. Alright. We got a Shugo, a Pryor, and a Kyoshin. I'm not the only one playing heavy. But yeah, we gotta make up for last night, don't we, guys? No. Yeah, we might need to restart the party after this, because your, your voice just keeps sounding really wonky, Hannah. Oh, no. Okay, well, let me go ahead and reset the phone. Yeah, we'll see if we can't do it. Uh, it's, it's, it just sounds weird. Hannah, I'll be right back, guys. We're trying to fix her audio issue. Hey, Rick, can't wait for the next to build. Already have Theodora built. Excellent. Excellent. That was an easy one to make. Like, Theodora is easy. One, what happened anyways last night? I wasn't having any issues playing the game. The, well, I'm glad you didn't have any issues. We did. We had tons of issues. Um, just it was really rough. Like we couldn't we couldn't get connected. Ubi Connect was down. It was down for uh, an hour or so. Hey, twenty dollars from Goo. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Let's see if we can't get Hannah reconnected. Thank you for the twenty dollars, Goo. Try reinviting her. Glad you aced your English test. It's awesome. Not a lot we could do there. All right, let's while we're waiting on this execution, and let's try to get Hannah back in. All right. Okay, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, Hannah. Now let's get yeah. the sh let's get the screen share going. Okay. You do sound a lot better. Yeah. I don't know what was going on there, but it's okay. Can you see the screen, Hannah? Yeah, I can see the screen. Can you still hear me good? Yeah, I can hear you. Oh, chat, can y'all hear Hannah good?
I love when they just press heavy. Watch this guy, he's just gonna press heavy. I got killed by my own teammate. That hurts. <laughs> but yeah, that, that all that all all shoot. This is the thing. I asked Havoc last night which he preferred, uh, Hitakiri's or Shugokis, and he said Shugokis. But I'll, and I agree, Hitakiri's are more pain to fight. But I'll be honest, both are pains in the asses because I feel like both are just hold down heavy, win. <laughs> like that's all it takes. So you're just saying like they're just a little too heavy to carry. Literally, they can carry the rest of their team, <laughs> but they are too heavy to deal with. Mm -hmm. Sounds about right. Okay, who's the hell are you playing as right now? Varingian. For some reason, I can't remember them. They're the newest hero. Oh, that's why. Is it gender locked? Yes, they're female. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, now I remember them. Yeah. Yep. God, I can't even get a kill this match. Because we're fighting the heavies. <laughs> Stinking heavies. Ravenite, what made you like Goblin Slayer? It's great. Goblin Slayer is inventive. It's a fantasy-style story that's not afraid to explore dark aspects. The character of Goblin Slayer is fun. It's not just another isekai where every female is just in love with the main character needlessly and... The main character isn't this heartthrob who's just really good with the ladies, and he's not OP as mess. He's just really intelligent. He's like a witcher, man. Like, genuinely, I look at Goblin Slayer like a witcher. Like, he's he's not a hero. He's a professional, you know? Eh, I still prefer the abridged version. Well, you haven't watched all of the original, have you? I watched, I think I got to the part where the... How did I get caught by... I dodged! Got him, thank you. Now let's kill him. Just so you guys know, that was a spoiler for um, Journey to the West. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Dang it, Kyoshin. You had to hit him sooner. What do I think about Berserk? I have answered that question so many times. So I'm going to say this in one sentence. I'm going to say this in one sentence. Because this is going to be my sentence whenever someone asks me. What do I think about Berserk? I watched it. I, it's not my favorite. I see why it has an audience. It's just not my favorite anime. That, that, that question has caused me no end of grief. When you watch the anime, were you watching like the 90s version or the... I think it was made like a newer one was made in 2010, I think. I think it was the 90s version because it was a long time ago. Okay. And it felt like 90s style animation too, so... Yeah, I mean the 90s animation was just, just, like, just amazing. When you look at anime now, it's like, eh. Wee! <laughs> I went flying. Anyway, five sentences. Yeah, so basically a paragraph. You know what? I, I said it in a paragraph. No, a paragraph consists of five sentences, though. I love that hybrid solve animation. It is a hybrid. All right, let's see what trouble I can get to. Let's see. Uh, I see you're going to press you're heavy? You're going to press heavy, bro? No, he's going to bash first. Kick. Nope. <laughs> this guy likes to trip me up even when it doesn't really help him.
Oh, he light parried. Okay. This is turning into a very weird fight. Anyway. <laughs> it says, hey, Hannah, how would you design a monster? Uh, I use uh, Pinterest for some concept ideas. Um, I've also downloaded a, downloaded a AI app called Spell AI, and I give it um, certain tags of what I'm looking for, and then it'll give me, like, different concepts and ideas, and I can just put them together. Um, I also look at other, um, concepts from other artists as well. Like, one of them that I really do like, um, is the creator of Made in Abyss. A lot of the designs that he comes up with, with the creatures in the Abyss, are really jingling very unique. Um, but yeah, that's what I pretty much do. I also try to look into the ideas, like what exactly does this monster do? What makes it dangerous? Um, so then I try to place that into the design as well. I'm dead. I got close, but that's Pryor for you. Pryor, I think, is probably one of the... Well, he's not the best heavy, but he's the best heavy that isn't broken. This is true. And he's got <laughs> Yeah, it's part of his helm. He's got pretty. He's got a pretty good design. Mm. No, because he is the king of heavies. I would say that Black Pryor is probably the ideal heavy. I do like the way Pryor plays. I think that they're a really strong character, but I don't think that they're OP. I think Hitakiri, Shugoki, those characters are pretty OP. How did he get that health back? That should have been enough to kill him! <laughs> Magic! Hey, the sorcerer! It's a witch! It's a witch! Burn the witch! Goki, why are you running? You asshole, Goki! Oh. Was he needing a running start? No, I'm getting my kill. I'm getting the kill. That was, uh, execution was pretty smooth. Yeah, he, Varengian's got some great executions. She really does. Yeah. I mean, there's some I'm like, eh. For, uh, uh, hey, Aaron, how you doing, bro? Aaron says hi to both of us. Hi. <laughs> Don't be an asshole, Hannah. <laughs> Anyway, well, they've rallied. We might, I thought we had this one on clutch, but maybe not. Maybe not. I like the design of the, the shield, though. It's pretty nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's a good shield. He's definitely got the drip, and he has a and he has a one-piece uh, emblem, so can't go oh, wrong. okay, okay. I mean, look at his emblem. I'm pulling it right now. See that? Yeah, I can see that. It's a one-piece. Yeah, it's How got this. Kind of one-piece emblem? Uh, I haven't made one yet. Well, you need to get on that. Yeah, I probably do. Yeah, because the one piece is real. How come I can't punish him missing that? That's the... I feel like I should... Thank you, God. I'm tired of fighting this guy alone. There you go. There you go. Good use of that feet, bruh. 
Yay, we leveled up. Do we need a straw hat helmet for pirate all One Piece fans? Yes, yes. Wouldn't it be awesome if we could get her a straw hat? Like, just straight up a straw hat. That would be pretty nice. Yeah, dude's just gonna, ju dude's just gonna parry on red. Yeah! That's how it goes. That's how it goes. I'm gonna lay on my saber tooth belt here. That's how it goes, baby. Where the, uh, where the saber tooth cat come from? Oh, it's just a cool uh, signature you can use. Hmm. Uh, Mayo left. The, the Black Prior left. He got mad at the. He got mad that we that they lost. Oh no. Anyway. That was fun. That that went really well. Okay. Yay. And I completed my storied order and my strong order. It looks like so we can grab a new set. Um. I hear your Gracie. She doesn't say much. Ignore her. All right. Now I've got to do attacker, faithful, and agile. That means I've got to do a samurai and an assassin. So either Shinobi or Orochi. Ooh. Hey, Raven, are you going to be playing with Havoc or is it as... Um, if Havoc ever plays for honor to stream, he usually starts around six my time. So about two hours ago. Um, and he hasn't started, so I don't think it's going to happen. I don't think he's playing tonight. If he messages me right now and says, Hey, Raven, I'm not going to stream, but I'll play with you, then I'll let him join. But I, I mean, guys, he's four hours ahead of me. He lives in England. So right now where he is, it's midnight. You know, it's past midnight. So I don't think he's doing it. I don't think he's doing it. Um, it's that's fine, though. That's fine. We, we can still do this. That, oh, we, that's they, loser talk. Uh, I'm going to play Shinobi. Let's play Kimiko. Let's play Kimiko, guys. Oh, it's an all samurai. T what? Two Orochi, a Shugoki, and a freaking Shinobi? Baby. Army of the Rising Sun. Oh my gosh, it's almost a full samurai team. The only one that's not samurai is PK over there. They got a peacekeeper hiding in the back row. <laughs> She's the spy. She's the spy. No, she's the imposter among us. No! <laughs> it's the invasion of the weebs! But yeah, I don't think, uh, I don't think have. Oh, wait, no, there, one of theirs quit. Oh, no. He saw all the weebs and he said, I'm out. Hey, Raven, have you looked over my buddy Patrick's story? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Weebs assemble! We have to protect the body pillows. Who needs havoc when you have a Hannah? <laughs> Thank you, Mercy. You're dang right. Hey, Raven, how you doing? I'm okay, man. I'm doing okay. Been a lonely Saturday. So by the way, Raven, have you been organizing on the faction war with Westhold? Do you think we can win this season? I'm optimistic. Whoa! Oh my gosh! That 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 Orochi got away with it. Professor Sen uh, Professional Syndic says, "Hannah, you own a cat." No, it's the dog. It just likes me out like a cat for some reason. Really <laughs> no, nah, she has a cat. It's a fat cat named Gracie. I did not name it Gracie. It was um, given to me by my grandma when she passed. So, now she is in my care, and I kind of like to spoil her sometimes, but other times, like, uh... She's probably meowing me. I just What? 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 Just, what? How did... What? How did that happen? Did you guys see that? Okay. People in chat, what just happened? 
I thought he had me. I was like, oh man, I, I threw I threw a heavy out of stam. I thought I was about to. I I thought I. I I got an out of steam and a heavy. I was like, oh no, she's gonna parry it. And I got it! How? How? That should not have happened. That, sh that should not have happened. Hannah, I, th I think you are my good luck charm tonight. I'll, no, I'll tell you how it happened. I'll tell you how. It was the power of friendship. The power of friendship and this ninja skill I just found. And Gracie. I'm gonna go up to A, I don't wanna lose it. You lost zone A. Hannah good lick charm? What, Aaron? What? Aaron, uh, Hannah, do you even have chat up? Uh, I do, but... So I'm having to watch it through, like, my phone, because... Oh, oh, I got gotcha. you. Yeah, yeah, and like... So my phone is is set up to charge, so I'm having to like swivel my chair to the side to see the chat. But I figure if like you have it up too, so I'm sure you'll let me know when someone's asking me a question. Oh crap! I didn't I didn't think I'd get caught with that. Anyway, by the power of friendship. By the power of Greystone. By the power of Grayskull. I have the power. I'm pretty good with Shinobi. Oh, trust me. I'm not that good. I think I'm just up against bad players. No, it's just like people say, it's because I'm here. Yeah, that could be it too. <laughs> Okay, just got, who's in the voice chat? This is Hannah. She's one of my artist friends. She's the one who draws uh, all the really cool art, like the thumbnail you're seeing, like the uh, chibi thumbnail you're seeing. Yeah, it's me. She asked if she could join. And I said yes. He had no choice. I wasn't giving him a choice. Friendship is the only cure to lightning bolt to the face. This is true. <laughs> no, that's not tape. Oh god, I got caught. No! Don't let me get away with that! LET ME GET AWAY WITH THAT! Wow, two kills? Right now I've got a total of four kills and one death. Wow, you're just, you're just on a roll, man. You're on fire. Kimiko don't take prisoners tonight. Mm-hmm. But as Havoc has said many times, uh, Shinobi is just plain busted. Maybe that execution was just the friends we made along the way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no. 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 It's funny, but no. Ooh, good parry. I didn't think you'd fall for it. Good pair. Whoa. Get away. I need to heal. I need to heal. Get away. Ah. I need a healer. Ah. Run, I run, need to I need to jog in. Now it's just speed. Kill card. You lost zone A. That was smooth. Smooth as butter. Yep. Okay, healed up. We can go now. Oh, we won. Never mind. Yay! Drop that kill card. Hold on. There we go. 
So so Kimiko is Blackthorn's boo. Uh, yeah, his wife actually. Kimiko becomes Blackthorn's wife. I will be releasing that story later. I think I've got it all figured out. I'm gonna try to release it uh, tomorrow or Tuesday. I wanted to release Wait, it today, what? but I ran out of time. Wait, what story? Uh, the Legend of Kimiko. Oh, okay. All right, I've got five takedowns as an assassin and one samurai match. I gotta play as another samurai. Samurai, like any samurai? It can be any samurai. Um, any samurai? Any samurai. I know which one you could play as. Which one? Uh, who's the one you hate? Uh, to play, hate to play as or hate to fight? Yes. Because I hate to play as Aramusha, but I hate to play against Kyoshin. Oh. Alright, chat, what do you think? Aramusha or Kyoshin? Mmm. I mean, I'm going with Aramusha, just because I like to see you suffer. I know you do. Yeah, I do. It brings so much joy into my life. Actually, it's pretty close. People are people are kind of tied here. Come on, guys! All right, looks like Aramush is winning. Woo! Are you excited? Not really. I'm pretty bad with Aramusha, so. <laughs> Hey, don't worry, you got me. We've been winning so far. I feel like there's too much weeb. Is Hannah playing? No, Hannah's not playing. She's just joining me in voice chat. I don't know how to play. I just button mash. That's kind of how a lot of people win it, actually. They just button mash. They just turn off their <laughs> brain and go, Hibby! You'd be a pretty good Hitsukiri or Shugoki. Uh, I'd probably do Hitsukiri, honestly. <laughs> You would piss off <laughs> Havoc, that's for sure. <laughs> just for that, just out of pure spot, I would do that. Raven say Ara Ara is Michelle. Who's Mi No way, hell no. Michelle from Monster <laughs> Club? Hell no. Come on! Mm-mm. Oh, come on. <laughs> Not on a live stream. Okay. But Raven, you got weeb two katanas. What else? True. Looks like the Shogun got pissed today. Pretty much. Just place your Goki Raider on on Hyper Kiri and you'll do just fine. Um, yay! We give Hannah joy and make Raven suffer. Wah ha 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 ha! Yay! Perfect. It is true. Best birthday present ever. Raven, are you ever gonna do an RD2 live stream? Oh, a Red Dead 2 live stream? Is that what you mean? Yeah, I think that's what it is. Uh, probably not. Um, my brother was the one who loved Red Dead 2 more than me. I mean, I liked it. I did. But, uh, I mean, he's already talked at length about it. I I'm not sure I, I could do that. Maybe one day. Say Ara Ara. I just did. Ara Ara. I did. I did it. No. Wasn't that just so hot? I'm not what they meant. Wait, what? wonder what it sounds like he's saying in a Scottish accent. Crap. Thank you. Crap. Yes! Oh my gosh, I held out just long enough to be saved by my weeb team! <laughs> Hooray! I have the power of God and anime on my side! Okay, let's not go overboard here. Raven can say, Raven, say one cannot simply walk into Mordor. Oh, okay. One does not simply walk into Mordor. This is true, you have to give him a notice. 
This dude can light parry everything. Oh my gosh. Okay. Aura main man, you got it, Goo. I totally am. Aaron was right. Hannah is a luck charm. I don't know about the lick, but thanks for the luck champ. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that either. I don't know about it either. I'm, I'm kind of confused by it. But, uh, we... Yeah, I don't know. Uh-oh, we got a thanker. We got a uh -oh, thanker. SpaghettiOs. Hey, Aaron, did you, have, did you hear that they added female custodies in 40k? They... Oh, you mean the Sisters of Silence? They've always had that. We just haven't heard about them because they're very silent about their presence. Gah! But yeah, I don't... I, I mean, if you, if you mean... If when you say female custodians, if you mean the Sisters of Silence, I already knew about them. They're technically part of the custodian faction, so. The sisters are silent, dude. Be silent. That no that Nusha can really parry. Raven's personal crusade yeah. against Thankers is always fun. That it is. say I am the dominator in an evil voice define evil <laughs> hey I'm alive that's nice now nah, we can't keep doing this we got to take zones I'm gonna go to C I know that these guys are gank oh berserkers a th that raiders a thanker I love it when they're thankers. Thanks. Dang it. Hello. There's no way that's a there's no way that's a ret seven news She's better than that. <laughs> okay, Aaron is saying since I'm no fun, you have to say Ara Ara. Me? Yes, you. Me? <gasps> he wants me to say it. He says, since I'm no fun, you have to say it. I can say it any way I want. I mean, I don't know. You, he didn't specify. Uh, all right. I, 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 there, she said it. Ah, Kyoshin, you annoy the hell out of me. Ah, screw you, Kyoshin, you weeb son of a bitch. Someone said, uh, Raven, it's your turn. No, it's not. Yes, it is. I did it. Now you have to do it. God, this. What are you doing? A fate? Are you doing a cry over me, Kyoshin? You're playing one of the most cringe characters in the game. If you're actually going to act trolly, pick a new character. said Aura Aura, I just didn't say it in the voice y'all wanted me to.
There, he's dead. Whoa! What, you didn't like it when someone used a feed on you? You poor baby. Raven, will you play the Injustice games? No. No, I don't play those games. I tried them. I, I'm not. I'm just not a big fan of those kind of fighting style games, like the, those t, 2D fighting games that require button mashing all the time, like in different combination moves. No, I'm not into that. It kind of reminds me of uh, Mortal Kombat, honestly. <laughs> My R R is just fit differently. <laughs> Raven, you're doing really good with Aramusha. I've got six kills and died six times. I, I beg to differ. <laughs> I mean, I think they're doing pretty good. Oh, uh, they threw a fourth feet right as I got revived. Dang it. Uh... And it was Kyoshin who threw it. And he's dropping thanks, too. Oh, they're all cringe. Okay. So, Berserker and Merknim, their names are. I have a feeling they will be quitting after this match. It's very typical of their kind. Anyway. Injustice made by Nether Realm, which Oh, and now Raider's Ra Raider, you're doing your little emote. Okay. Alright. Alright, Raider. I see you. Just don't quit. I'm gonna come back and kick your ass, so don't quit now. Don't quit now. Yeah, we're gonna play Warden next time. We're gonna we're gonna play Warden this time. Let's see them let's see them talk after Warden. <laughs> let's see let's see them do it. Gonna get the warden. Alright. Oh, Berserker's ready to go! He's ready to go! Excellent! Alright, alright. Kyoshin, you need to stay too. Kyoshin, you need to stay too. You better stay too, Kyoshin. Don't quit. Let's go. Okay, one of them quit, but it wasn't him. Come on. Stay with me. Stay with me, bro. And, no, no, no. Kyoshin's still there. Kyoshin's still there. Yes. Yes. <laughs> it's like, I have your number. Let's go. Come on. Are you going to play with viewers tonight? No, nah, probably not. We're already this deep in. We'll probably just stick to what we have. Hannah is the treat tonight. Oh, man. The cringe Kyoshin's on my team. Oh, well. No. Oh, well. We can still get, we can still get that raider. Let's take Ruth to him. Let me remind. Let me go ahead and remind you of the most famous thing pagans ever did: convert. What about Tekken or Street Fighter games? Same thing with me. Like, here's the thing: I don't like those kind of 2D style, like face-to-face -face fighting where it's all about combination, like left, left, right, 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 attack, attack, guard, right, like that kind of. Thing. I'm not into that. Like, I'm I'm more of an open field kind of battle thing. Uh, Raven, it's um, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start. Exactly. <laughs> All right, they've got two Nobushi, so we can expect a lot of bleeding. Um, the Raider again, who's going to be cringe. And uh, Shaolin. Why did we just lose a teammate? Come on, bro, don't be cringe. Stay with the team. I wonder why people love Street Fighter. It's just popular. Yeah, and it's been around for a while. Yeah, they've got two Nobus, a Shaolin, and a Raider. This will not be easy, but I don't care if we win or lose as long as I put Raider in his place. Hey, yeah, favorite candy? Um, I would have to say take five, but I kind of like it, like the version before Reese's bought it. All right, Gracie, wish me luck, too. <laughs> Gracie doesn't know what she's talking about. Hannah, do you have a favorite color? Not pink. Not pink, okay. And actually, let me, let me specify. I like I... the cool colors. I'm not big on bright colors. It doesn't look good on me. All right, let's go, people. we got a fight to win.
Will you ever do a Helldiver stream? I have done one, and I'll do one in the future, probably. Yeah, I did one. I did it with Will. Wait, this is probably around the time where, like, Helldiver still wasn't working for me, right? Yeah. Oh, that's why. Ah, I couldn't... I couldn't parry both lights. I had to pick one. Nobushi, Nobushi ganking is the worst. Uh, her correct name is Nobushi. Yeah, but when she's ganking, when she, her, that is her, that may be one of her correct names, but when they're ganking you, they're Nobu Horshi. Oh, you mean bitch? If it, essentially, yes. I was being polite. <laughs> I'm not. Come on, let's turn this around. We've got a Goki on our team. It should help. There we go. There we go. Look at these Nobushis hiding behind each other. God, that is cringe. Ah! That is so. Cr I hate when Nobushi's team up. It is the most cringe shit. Hey, Fallout TV show. Heard of it? Heard of it? Don't want to see it. I have no interest. None whatsoever. None. I will not watch it. You cannot ask me to watch it. I refuse. I actually like Fallout and the world it creates. I think it's really neat. I'm not giving it my time or energy. What if I gave you money to... Reveal? It better be a good amount of money. <laughs> okay. Alright, that's Nobushi. Number one down. Yay! Brain splattered everywhere. Daddy, Both Nobushi's dead by the hands of Ruth. I know, Gracie. I know. It is. Another one down. Another one back, back. Hi, Raider. Raider! Alright, let me be right back. I gotta go feed Gracie. You notice Berserker's not... Whoa! <laughs> He's not saying thanks no more! Feed my revenge, boys. Alright, 
I'm back where they live. Still reminding these people of God's true gift. Forgive me? Nah. Vengeance on the unjust. Oh my. And forgiveness, that too. That too. Very important, but legit, uh, vengeance is also very important as well. Well, Raider, come on back. Let's go again. <laughs> his knees or something? Stabbed him straight through the throat. Alright, Raider! You want to come back for another round? Round three. Fight! Raider's gone to fight Shugoki. That won't go well for him. <laughs> he jumped down there like, Raider! Raider's probably going, Oh god, no, not again. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa! Shocking, isn't it? I guess you're not as good as you thought, filthy pagan! And now we kill the last one and win this. Come on now. Come on now. There we go. There we go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, I love that. Wow. Mm. Mm. That's the rule, boy. You want to act toxic? You better win every fight. Or else you might not like how it turns out. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah, vindication. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I'm in my Bible study tomorrow. I'm going to be talking about uh, resisting the urge for revenge. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> That was too perfect. Oh Dude, God. that was... Mwah, that was beautiful. That that was beautiful. That and fool... Later on, you're like... <laughs> later on, you're like... It tastes like vinegar in my mouth now. That, well, he got his. That's the thing. He got... He got his... Like... That's the thing. That's the thing. Vengeance is the Lord's, and I am his messenger. <laughs> you're supposed to turn the other cheek, though. Uh, okay, so, like, yeah, honestly, uh, tomorrow I am going to be doing a, um, message on revenge. Uh, <laughs> that, that, that wasn't even a joke, I honestly am. Oh my god. Um, uh, okay, so, now that I've gotten vengeance. <laughs> yeah, now you've gotten that out of your system. <laughs> Ruth is now officially an Oath of Vengeance Paladin. <laughs> You got that right. <laughs> oh, I wish I wish Havoc had been there to see that. Just get get wrecked by a raider, come back as a warden, kick his ass. That's how it goes. Oh my god. Honestly, Havoc would have done it even better than me. <laughs> All right, what are my orders? What I got? What do I got to do? Um, I got to take one more zone, fight as a samurai, and fight as an assassin. Um, who is close in any of those camps? Um, Peacekeeper. Kyoshin's really close. Um, no, Peacekeeper. 
Peacekeeper already reached rep 33. She's not close in anything right now. Um, she is, but she's not close yet. I need to play someone who's close. Let's go Kyoshin. Kyoshin is pretty dang close. Graven, is your sanity doing better? Oh, after that, it's like I took Prozac. <laughs> We're really going with the weed teams this, uh, this night. Well, it's because there's a lot. There's a samurai order going on, so everybody wants to play samurai to get that order done. Army of the Rising Sun. Hey, Raven, thoughts on gamers playing old games rather than new ones? Well, I don't know the statistics of it, so I'm not going to say whether that's true or false, but I'm not surprised by it either. I feel like... So many AAA games these days are just really sabotaging themselves, hurting themselves in a big way. So it doesn't Shooting surprise me. In the foot. I mean, I kind of sometimes I prefer playing the older games for nostalgic reasons. Yeah, for sure. And sometimes they're hard to find. But okay, now that we've gotten the uh, toxicity done with, let's get into a good fight. Let's have a good fight. And then another thanker shows up. Thank you, thank you. Raven, was that revenge worth it? In a in a game like this, yeah, I don't. I, revenge is revenge is fine. I'm, I, when when I do my Bible study tomorrow, it'll be like legit, like. Strike. Yep, the anime strike. Oh my god. Raven, is it a sin to want revenge? It's not a sin to be angry. It's not a sin to be upset with somebody, but it is a sin to let uh, personal wrath rule your judgment. So as long as you have a clear head, you're good to go. Crap. <laughs> Nothing I can do. That Goki was just going to headbutt me the minute I got locked in an animation. Oh, man. Anyway. Love the Fallout TV show. I'm glad you do. I'm, I'm not going to watch it. I, I'm not going to watch oh, it's it. A, it's out already? Yeah, it's out. And it took everything I had to watch the One Piece live action show. I, I'm not... Oh, I didn't know you did that. How yeah, I've watched it. I've watched it now. I've officially watched the One Piece live action. I thought you told me about it. Cause I'm yeah, it, it wasn't it. it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. It actually was pretty good in some areas, but there are still some problems I had with it, honestly. Yeah, because I remember you were... I think you were, like, telling me some of the issues you had, and I'm like, yeah, I can share that. I think what helps with shows like that, you just have to make sure you have your expectations are like so far down, like all the way rock bottom. That way it's like, if it's a disappointing show, you're not going to be disappointed. Thank you, sir. Now let me do another anime kill. What are the problems with One Piece Live Action? You know, okay, so there are obviously some things that are just not going to work as well, and some of the effects didn't work as well for me. Oh, let me finish this off. And blood out. Um, as I was saying, oh, let me go over here. My subjects don't seem to like transfer to live action very well. Yeah, it's just not going to transfer as well, I don't feel like. Um, then there's also the fact that some of the, a, a lot of the actors, to their credit, did a really good job. Um, like, 
Hawkeye, Zoro, the guy who played Luffy did pretty well. Usopp had some great moments. The guy who played Usopp. Like, there was this moment where Sanji kicks a fish man in the Baratier, and uh, he falls into a table. And uh, when the table tips over, you see Usopp was hiding underneath it, looks around, sees he's not hidden anymore, and starts crawling away quickly. I was like, that was funny. That's an Usopp moment. That, that, that's very much an Usopp moment. So they handled that well. The part, the thing I didn't like was other than a few moments, which granted, there were a few, the, the lady who played Nami, ugh, there were times I was like, could you please have an emotion? Like when Zoro was fighting Mihawk, for example, the uh, like it's, Luffy and uh, Usopp looked worried. They were like, oh man, is, is our boy Zoro going to win this? Um, meanwhile, <laughs> meanwhile, Nami's just kind of like, eh, I wonder what I'll be doing when the shot is over. Am I going to get lunch or? Wait, I thought like by that time Nami was already like gone with the ship. Yeah, they changed it. They changed the format a little bit. I'm not going to, I'm not going to spoil anything. So don't ask for how all the stuff they changed, but I'm just talking about minor things. Um, uh, like performance and stuff, but they did change a few things. Um, like in terms of format, like they actually had Karubi, one of the fishermen, show up at the Baratier, which it was kind of like, really. They had, they, yeah, yeah. yeah, they had, uh, I mean, then again, you could argue with the fact that maybe at that time, like, Nami doesn't really care about them very much. You could argue that, but Nami in the in the manga was, and in the anime was always an emotional person, she couldn't help but care about people. Like, keep in mind that at the Baratier, she did care enough to, like, cry when she left them. Oh, Are you really? kidding? He powered through the full combination? Ah, uh, there was nothing I could do. Ah, uh, that's why I hate Gokis, man. You can you can catch them with a counter strike and go into your combo. They'll still power through it. Anyway, it at least respects the manga for the most part. Yes, yes, for the most part. And I will give Nami's actress this: when she did the Luffy help me scene, I won't lie, she did good there. That was a pretty damn good scene. They handled it pretty well. Um, uh, but I but I think Lark said it best. Lark said it best when I talked to him about it. It could not work without the anime. Like, uh, like what I mean by that is this. You might think that's kind of obvious, isn't it, Raven? But what I mean by that is, like, if the anime didn't exist, this show wouldn't have taken off. It would have been seen as weird and stupid and kooky. And people are like, well, yeah, obviously it's meant to get people into the anime. Well, my response is this. If you couldn't stand the anime and watch the live action instead, you're not going to like the anime after that anyway. I think that the live action did good in a lot of areas. I think that it had some creative ideas, and it definitely had a unique direction. Like I said, there were things about it I really liked. There were just some things that, eh, as a One Piece fan, it just didn't it, it didn't please me as much, and that's fine. We're all we're all allowed to have our differences of opinion. Yeah, and sometimes we're wrong with those opinions, but yeah. But yeah, that, that's where I stand on it. Like, I think what I'll say is this. I think it's fine. I think it does a good job. It's definitely one of the better anime live action adaptations I've ever seen. And I never would have thought that they would do well with a One Piece live action adaptation. Like, I honestly didn't expect that. But they did impress me. There were, there were parts that I thought were just as good as the anime. And then there were some parts that was like, mm, nah. Like, I'll give this. Like, they... Like, they had... Son Sanji's actor did a pretty stinking good job. Like, I'm like, it's going to be really hard to mimic all those kicks. But he made it work. There were a few moments where I was kind of like, Ugh, that was an awkward bit of choreography. Could have probably reshot that. Um, one of the things that annoyed me, though, is they constantly showed Zoro fighting without the third sword in his mouth. They kept showing him just doing two-sword style. Like, he did two-sword style almost the whole time against Mihawk. And I'm like, nah. Yeah, but, like, how would you be able to really show that without it feeling like, awkward? I know, but at the same time... I, I know. I'm sorry, I'm just too much of a One Piece fan not to notice it. I know. 
I know, I, I, I like it, especially if he's going up against Mihawk, you would think he go, would go all out. That's why I can't do a video talking about, oh, here's why the One Piece live action is good or bad. I can't do that because I'm going to be biased. I'm going to say, uh, it was so much better than the anime because they did it this way. I'm like, well, of course they did it better than the anime. It, it, One Piece is an anime thing. It's kind of like when they made the live action 101 Dalmatians. It, it, I feel the same way. It's a good adaptation. It does some stuff well, but it's just not going to be as good as the animation, you know? I mean, honestly, it's better than the live action that Disney is doing now. What about the live action Last Airbender show? I have not watched it, and I don't want to. <laughs> My sister has, but she she likes it. But then again, like she has other opinions about stuff that I disagree with, so I can't really. Usopp doesn't have his nose, which is said. Yeah, yeah, they didn't give him the long nose. That is, that is true. Okay, we need to pull out a Dominion briefly to do some brawls. I did like see clips of the actor who did Buggy, and I feel like that. He kind of portrayed Buggy a little bit better in the live action than the anime. He wasn't as annoying in the live action than he was in the anime. In the in the animated ver in the live action version, he was trying to play a bit more intimidating, which I get. I get that, but at the same time, Buggy's meant to be kind of a joke. Like that's that's kind. Yeah. Of... Oh yeah, yeah. Like I I totally agree, but I think like during the Marine Ford arc, I think I just. I got so annoyed with him. Yeah, no, I agree. He's a joke character. I agree. But, like, but I think it also was the fact that, like, the Marine Ford arc was just so freaking... It, it felt like being right back into the original Dragon Ball, where it's like, Goku's holding the spirit bomb for five episodes. What's gonna happen next? Who knows? Goku's gonna be holding the spirit bomb, though. Yeah, no, I get... I agree. And that was my biggest problem with the Marine, with the Marine Ford arc, just... I liked it, but it dragged. It dragged for oh, way God, too long. It was awful. <laughs> like, Raven Knight, if, if, promise, like, I don't even care. if we ever get a fairy tale live action, it'll either be boobs or so much censored that it wouldn't be funny. Now, if we got a fairy tale live action, it, they would. They, it would be um, just awful. Like because there's no way they could replicate it. They'd they they ruin it. They try to make they they try to make Natsu gay for gray. I'm almost certain of it. Um, nah, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> I mean, look what happened with, um... Kevin apparently... Uh, oh, oh, by the way, I got news that apparently they've changed Tomb Raider. Like, they made her, like, non... Uh, they tried to de make her a, a, a non-colonizer now or something. Hey, Raven, would you consider giving Shogun a chance? The show? I've watched it. I've, I have watched it. And it's good. I like it. I think it's really well done. It's not like the book, but it's better than what I thought it would be. That's a shock. Well, I thought that they were going to turn... Um, I thought they were going to make a bunch of girl bosses and make it unhistorical. And other than one or two scenes that I didn't like, the rest of it's been really good. Like, I liked it. Gotcha. I was like, it's so hard for you to have any good expectations for any show. Like, anytime I see a trailer for a movie or a show that I might seem interested in it, at the back of my head, I'm like don't be interested in it because most likely it's gonna suck like what was that the one uh, damsel by the trailer looks interesting but then i hear what other people are saying it's like oh well thank goodness i didn't waste my time on that okay okay Crap. There's no way they would ever be able to do a Black Lagoon live action. There's just no way. Nah. No way. Like, they would have to censor the crap out of it or just change it completely. There's just no way. I mean, are you surprised that these companies are trying to destroy the past? No, I'm not. I kind of see it coming. Yeah. Alright, so the Warden is obviously good. He's a rep one. No, no, he's a Smurf. He's... He came from a different platform. He plays Warden way too well. Nah. No way is he just a rep one. Where does the term Smurf come from? I'm not entirely sure. Like, when I hear Smurf, I just think of the blue people. And then when As I you should. Talking about, it's like, oh, it's a, it's a Smurf account. It's like, well, how does that term have anything to do with the account? I don't know. Maybe it's just because, like, I'm not a pro gamer, so I don't, like, know all the terms and whatnot. Mm 
Come on, Glad, you got this. I'll let you... No, you know what? No, I don't get... I'm not going to let you have it. Good move. Like I was going to fall for it three times in a row? Victory. Wait a minute, are you playing with Snow White? No, I just picked the first Peacekeeper. Oh, okay. But I see, like, there was certain parts where I was like, wait a second. Alright, let's go, Warden. This boy can light parry very well. I win again. Victory. All right, Glad. It's up to you. Don't disappoint me now. You got this, Glad. There you go. Good toe stab. Good parry. And the Glad takes the win. Yay. Nice. No, I've never touched Twisted Metal. Isn't that like a racing game? Yeah, I don't know anything about it. Oh, good catch. Ooh, another light fairy. Damn. What the hell? How are these people so effing good at light fairies? What? There's no way you're... Are you a smurf? I mean, I'm not a smurf. I, I like a, are you using a script? There's no way you're using a script. That was ridiculous. That was that was pretty sus. Round five. Suspicious. All right. Good move. Oh well. Uh, you were close. The shaman was essentially parrying on red. The minute she saw a blink, she would go for the parry. Here she kind of makes me squirm a little. Like, just imagine, like, you're dying, and then you just feel that going up your chest. <laughs> hey, Raven, this is an idea. It would be really awesome if you make a live, a live where you 1v1 us. No, I will, I will probably never do that, Micah. I will probably never, ever do that. And I'll tell you why. Because um, I have a sneaking suspicion that there... I mean, many of you probably play better than I do. And I have a sneaking suspicion that um, some of you would use that as clout against me. Not that, not you specifically, but there are some people out there who I know have joined my community with the specific intention of dueling me so that they can get clout and say, hey, look, I beat a YouTuber. Like, and I'm not as good at this game as other people, so I don't want to end up in that boat. All right. Still got to play as a samurai. How many more samurai battles do I need? 
three. I need to I need to play as a samurai three more times. Let's go, Hito. Hi, Griffey. Yeah. How is Peacekeeper an assassin that has enhanced lights? I don't know. How is Berserker an assassin who has so much hyper armor? I mean, I don't mind playing against viewers every now and then, or like if it were a private thing, like if we were just doing it like on Discord or something, that'd be one thing. But to do it live, I have a feeling what would happen is someone may say, oh, Raven's live and he's dueling against people. They'll pop in and say, hey, Raven, I'm a fan. I'd like to duel you. I'll add them. We'll play. They'll beat me. And then they'll run and make a YouTube video saying I beat Raven Knight. And all I can say to that is, congrats, you beat a loser. <laughs> <laughs> That, like, you, you win no brownie points. Alright. Orochi, you gonna wake up? Or am I gonna start wailing on you? Alright. Oh, Gracie's watching the stream. Damn! It's one dodge happy Orochi. I kind of like that Hitakiri's uh, design, though. Yeah, that's Kiku. So what you mean to tell me that Oro that that Orochi literally just stood there, wanting me? Okay, it's gonna be one of those matches. There, thank you, Highlander. That's an interesting um, emoji. Yeah, the guitar thing, yeah. Well. Oh no. We got a very we got a uh, good fight, good fight, good fighter. Ah, Orochis. They're cringe. Did you just play an Orochi? Man, he is a dodger. Yeah, this dude is just taking advantage of dodge cancellations. That's annoying. Good fight, good fight, good fight. Boom. Victory. Woo. Yep. Later, Mac. Cringe, motherfucker. Why didn't you go for your heavy, bro? Them lights. I think Highlander would have won if his health wasn't lower. Oh, act like a bitch, why don't you? Round 
All right. the hell? I dodged. Screw Orochis, man. You can delete them for all I care. Yeah, that tracking is ridiculous. He does not need this much power. I fucking hate Orochis, bro. What the actual hell? Orochis can do Orochis dodge at dodge attacks are undodgeable. Their their storm rush is undodgeable. They have uh, they have dodge cancellations. They have what they have deflect capability. Everything they do, like, they don't need all that. They are still broken as sin. I don't know. I don't know if he was lag switching, but I know that he's a. I know that that was cringe as hell. Did I get done with that order? Yeah, I got done with the brawling order. I can get out of that. Good. Okay. Ugh, that annoys me. So is that like something new that they just released? What, Orochi and what he can do? No, he's always been able to no, do that. No, just... no, 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 the, the two-on-two brawl. No, that, that's always been there. Brawl's always been there. I just don't normally play it. Okay, I, I guess it's like I've just never noticed it. Like, j legitimately... Orochis, I feel, are too strong. I really do feel that way. Like, they are too strong. When they were first released, everyone hated them because of their light spam. They took away that light spam, but gave them dodge cancellations, undodgeable uh, dodge lights, and uh, undodgeable dodge lights. Uh, they gave undodgeable capabilities to their storm rush. Um, they just became unstoppable. You could, you, you just pick up Orochi, you, you pick up uh, Orochi and just spam your dodge cancels. I wonder if they, they uh, fixed that some time ago. Raven, could you play uh, Kensei? Yeah, I think I could play Kensei. Let me see. Yeah, the music's pretty nice. Kind of reminds me of Fable. Yeah, this is actually the original night theme music for For Honor that came out with the game, but they've updated it a little bit. Yeah, it's pretty nice. All right, let's play Kensei. Oh, uh, is it your girl, can you say? Uh, this is Maiko. Well, I've had a lot of people yeah. shoot... I've had a lot of people shoot me comments saying that they quit because of Orochi. Like, they quit the game because of Orochi. And I'm like, I don't... Uh, I don't... I, I believe you. Like, understandable. I think I think the easiest way to fix Orochi, there are two ways you can do it: either make his ru storm storm rush undodgeable, make his uh, dodge lights dodgeable, or or take away his dodge cancellation on everything. That you can take that away too, because there's no way to punish it. There's no way to punish that. I have a third option for you though. I have a what? third option. What? Control Alt Delete. 
Yeah, there, there's that too. <laughs> Easy counter, Hitakiri. Micah, did you just miss what was played? Micah, I want you to rewind the rewind to the last brawl match I just played, and you tell me that Hitakiri is the hard counter to Orochi. Or everyone else in chat, you can let Micah know what happened last match. Like, y'all just let Micah know how wrong he is. No disrespect, of course, but... Nope! Hey, Raven Knight, how are you? I'm good, man. Just a cringe match last match. That was hard to stomach. What are you drinking right now? Tea. Oh, okay, okay. Understandable. What kind of tea? Sweet tea. Really, it's just it's just regular sweet tea. Yeah. Oh, okay. Like it's not like like green tea or ginger ale tea. No, or... just just sweet tea. You know, one of those yeah. kind of things. Hey, hey, we're starting! Yay! Okay. Ah. All right, all right, all right. It's only nine forty. Wow, I, I thought that it was later than that. No, it's eight thir uh, eight forty over here. Really, was it that bad? Yeah, go back and rewatch it, man. You're free to. Like it was pretty cringe. Oh yeah, now I remember this character. Do you remember Kensei? I remember her now, yeah. Yes, you do. Yeah, she's the love baby of a warden in the, uh, Nobushi. Oh no, not this character. Are you sure about what's this character? Maika was uh, a hero skin. I'm at the backstory behind her that you made. No, that's a different character. Oh, okay. Alright, I need to go heal. I need to go heal. Because I'm dying! You need a healer. And not just an anime healer, but an MMO healer. Maybe not, you inspired me to write my own stories about For Honor. I'm currently writing one where the main vanguards fight their way out of limbo. It's confusing, but it's going well. Awesome, man. Glad, glad I could inspire you. Alright, all healed up. Let's turn B around. All of Raven's male wardens end up with Nobushi. Um, <laughs> let me see. All of them? Uh, William did, yes. Um, and uh, y yes, Stephen did. This is this is also accurate. What was it like? All male? He said all male wardens. Yes, he said all of my male wardens ended up with Nobushis, yeah. and he's correct. Probably, probably Nobushi is like pretty fine looking, so. You should make a female Shigoki and just have a warning go out with her. It'd be like, um, what was that, uh, Oni's character girl name from Monster Masume? Tionisia? There we go. Like, make a female, uh, Shigoki like that. Make a, make a female Shugoki named T There are no female Shugokis. Well, we'll make one. Well, I meant, like, personality-wise. Oh, so make a male Shugoki, but with the personality of Tianisha. No, make a female Shugoki with the personality of her. But I can't make a female Shugoki because they're a male gender-locked hero. Well, I'm not saying, like, in the game. Oh, you mean, like, make a story about one. <sighs> oh. Mm, now we're there. Now we're there. Yeah, I think... I think so. I think I think I think I think that's what should work. Yeah, what do you, what do you guys think, Chad? Do you think that should be that would be a good idea? Let us know right now. And then like hashtag yes female should go to.
Oh, good, good catch. I didn't think he'd catch me with that. Well, we probably won't win this one, but I'm putting up a fight at least. Yeah. If they gave Lawbringer a female voice option but didn't change their body shape, would you be okay with that? Nah, I wouldn't hate it. Like, I mean, it's, I have a female Lawbringer right now. You can't tell because you can't see your face. Hey, Raven, I take back what I said about Hito being an easy counter. <laughs> You're good, man. Taken back B and A. Let's secure C. There we go. There we go. We haven't lost this. We haven't lost this. Funny. This centurion just ah! <laughs> Wow. Raven, I, I've wondered this for a long which is your longest story you've written in your legend series and which is your favorite? Um personal favorite is Aurelius. Which one's my longest? Shoot, that's a good question. I don't know which one my longest is. Um like longest like paper wise or longest video recording wise. Uh, if I had to put a guess on it, um Ryu, probably. It's gotta be sad for that Centurion. Throws a feed at me, it misses entirely, then I destroy him in a 1v1. <laughs> he rolled a feed, but he got spirit. <laughs> Yeah, I'd say Ryu's probably the longest. And my favorite one is Ruth, most likely. Ruth or Richard Blackthorn. <clears throat> Let's go, bro. Now that I think about it, did you name Richard Blackthorn after the main character from Shogun? I sure did. <laughs> okay. Wait, no, I was like, wait a second, why does the name sound so familiar? Victory for the Samurai! Foolish Samurai! Then I got it in Japanese. We did it! We killed one of our guys to do it, but we did it! Yay! <laughs> what? Raven, you were in Japanese. Say what in Japanese? That we win? Oh, oh. Let's say foolish samurai? Yeah. In Haku's uh, voice, but in Japanese. Uh, let's see. How would Aku say it in Japanese? I know how to say... I know how to say stupid samurai. Isn't it, is it Baka Samurai? It's, it's, um, Samurai no Baka. Uh, okay, okay. 
the foolish samurai. Anyway, um, I gotta play one more match as a samurai, and then I can finally play as, play as other characters. <laughs> one more time. Let's see. I want to play a different samurai. I, I, I want to play a different samurai than the ones I have been playing. So I gotta play either Shugoki, Nobushi, um, Orochi. Oh, there's the only three I can play. I played everyone else. So it's either Shugoki, Nobushi, or Orochi. One of those three. What do you think? Shugoki. Shugoki, Fat Man. Well, let's let, let's let the chat decide. Chat, tell us right now. Within forty-two, screw it, forty seconds. Tell us now. Raven, if you know a bit about Warframe, say the corrupt war speech in Japanese. I know nothing about Warframe, so I can't do that. <laughs> we go on to big boy. I go where I am needed. Even in death, I still serve. So since we're going to be making a female Shigoki, what would their name be? Um... Uh, let me think. Uh, it would have to be Japanese, obviously. Um, oh, but I'm oh, trying of to. Course, yes. Well, I'm trying to think of a good Japanese name that would suit Shugoku. Wouldn't it? Wouldn't it be funny if it's like a Japanese female name that means tiny and she's not? <laughs> or something like Imagine delicate, like like something like really delicate. Um, <laughs> yes. Like when, when, like when she was born, like she was very fragile, so they gave her a name that had something to do with that. Let me think. Um, let me think. I'm trying to think of the Japanese girl names I remember. I don't remember them all at the top of my head. Um, <laughs> I mean... <laughs> uh... Satsuki means azaleas. <laughs> um, I remember that. Uh, let me think. What are some others? Uh, uh, who can name her Momo, which means peach? Uh, nah. No? Nah. Okay. Um, let's see. Um, Himawari means sunflower. Should just be staring at the sun the entire time. Um, what about Kikya? We can put that in the maybe. Um, what about Tsubaki? Means camellia. I tried, and that was, like, my favorite character in My Hero Academia. <laughs> so you want to name her Tsubaki? Yeah. Sue for short. Tsubaki Tsu for short. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. How about P... Because... What about Peach? <laughs> <laughs> no. We can't do that because I don't want to name him after Ryoga. Oh, no. what's up? Because oh, you want to? Okay. What if we name her that? Like, what if we name her that? And she starts to have a therapist sense of direction. That'd be funny. That'd be very funny. <laughs> We're not naming her Peach Eye. Maybe that might be a cute little nickname for her, like lover or whatever. But no. I am the storm that is approaching. Oh man. Still like a pretty good song. Oh, oh crap. Good team up. Oh no. You died. Chop you by heart and you're too late cause you can't find a bad name. Pop me! You're going to scare people. No, I'm not. We'll just think it's Elmo. <laughs> Elmo. 
Hey Raven, hello from across the pond in the UK. It's currently 2.51 in the morning, and I am insanely sleepy, de sleep deprived. I appreciate you watching my stream this late, bro, but if you're, if you need rest, please. Go to bed. What if we make it that Sue, that Sue uh, is just a big hugger? Oh my gosh, she has broken many backs. <laughs> that can be her nickname for Cat. Oh, almost had him! She knows to do that kick. Wait a minute, I just had an idea. Okay, so what if she doesn't realize she's breaking back because no one has the heart to tell her, like, hey, you just broke my back. Because she's so nice. That may be it. <laughs> Sue is Sarah from Monster Club. <laughs> oh Sorry God. for me putting so much stuff and bothering you. Just a big fan. Wish I could show you my looks for Warden. Each of them have their own stories, too. Your work is inspired. Oh, you're cool, Shocker. Not a problem. I'm good. You played Kente for me, so it's the least I could do, man. Hey, no problem, Aiden. No problem, bro. Glad I could do it for you. And I had no idea you were British. Your PFP didn't give that away at all. <laughs> Had a cat in front of a Union Jack. God, he dodges those neutrals. I love it. Well, at least we know who's been training him. Piccolo. I got him with the light. Thank you. A fellow Brit colonizers think alike when it comes to good to a good continent. <laughs> Well, I'm a bloody yank, aren't I? Since I've got some Brits in the chat, maybe I can finally get this question answered. Why is being called a Muppet an insult? Because when I think of Muppets, I think of Kermit the Frog. But but apparently being called a Muppet is uh, is an insult. Like, if I say, you effing Muppet, it's apparently an insult. So, uh, it, like, And even last night, uh, Havoc was asked, would you rather fight a hundred... Uh, Hitakiris or be turned into a Muppet? And he said, I'd rather fight the 100 Hitakiris. And I'm like, wow. I'm like, I mean, sure, I wouldn't want to be a Muppet, but that's not fun. You know, Muppet, Muppets are puppets, and I'd have someone's hand up my ass. But um, what's, wrong with, what's wrong with Muppets? I'm very curious. Violation 101. I am so sorry. Ten dollars from Cuban World or Raven today. Many years ago, I came to grace this world. Some have asked me what my birthday wish is. I wish for your success. That is my wish. Hey, that's nice. nice happy birthday to you. Ah, uh, caught me with the dodge, heavy wolf. Thank you for the ten dollars. Really appreciate it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Thank you, Shocker. Appreciate that. Uh, and Aiden says it means you're easily manipulated and follow others without thinking about it first. Okay, that 
That makes sense. That actually that actually makes sense. Okay, I it was I wasn't being I wasn't trying to like insult or anything. I was just genuinely curious because when someone when someone says Muppet around me, my first thought is Kermit the Frog or Gonzo or Rizzo. Like I don't think that's an insult. Like if someone said you're a Muppet, like oh, which one? <laughs> but no, it's like apparently that's a thing. Hey Raven, can you Aku in a girl voice? Uh, I can't even girl voice, so <laughs> I don't know how I'd Aku in a girl voice. Um, but yeah, okay, thank you for answering that. I was always kind of curious about that. I <laughs> just, I just think that's so cool. N now I know not to call Havoc a Muppet. <laughs> <laughs> he did teach me what a bellend was, though. <laughs> what did he say? He said a bellend is, you know what, I'll tell you later. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, gotcha, gotcha, all right. Ran, the characters were named after that were named after the insult. Oh. I would love to be a Muppet jealous of the action they get. I can't even get a hug. I know, if even Kermit could get a pig, I mean What's ironic is even though Kermit's married to a pig, it's him who brings home the bacon. Thank you. Thank you, Hannah. Thank you. Thank you. That was awful. Fuck it's five AM. 5 a.m.? Where are you at? Master Sergeant, do you live in Russia? Where do you live, bro? Because it's 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 9 here. That means you're like... Gee, that's, that's a long... Are you like in Russia? India? Where are you from, bro? <clears throat> Which Muppet would, rush, would Raven be? I would say Kermit. Okay, if I were a Muppet, I don't know who I'd be. Uh, I feel like I'd probably either be... Like, Sam the Eagle sounds up my alley. Uh, well, what about Sweetums? Sweetums the Muppet? No. No? Okay, who do you think, the Anna? Rule, the rule is you have to be a chick. So I'll have to look. Well, Miss Piggy's like the only chick in the in the show. No, there's others, I'm sure. Name one. That's not Miss Piggy? Yeah. Well, I'm sure if I Google, I'll probably find something. <laughs> there was that one chick in the rock group, like in the band. Like, there was this band of Muppets, and one of them was a chick, I think. Mm. Make your own Muppet? <laughs> well, now I can finally play something other than a samurai. I need to play something other than a samurai. I'm getting sick of it. Um, so, should we put that on the list? I'm a, I'm a Muppet. <laughs> Muppet. Claire, Claire's a Muppet. All right, I haven't played Pirate all night. I need to play Pirate since I uh, put Pirate on the thing. We need to play Pirate at least once. Yeah, I think I think you need to. Yes. All right, we're going in as Pirate. I'd either be Rizzo the Rat or Animal. Uh, that's fair. Rizzo, Rizzo's tight though. Rizzo, 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 Rizzo be based, okay? Rizzo's the guy who says, you know what? Fuck the riches. Fuck the bitches. I just want my food. <laughs> <laughs> he just want his food, man. And you can't, like, you can't argue with that, you know? It's, it's hardcore. Rizzo's got it where it's at. Rainbow, or no, want me to play Rainbow Connection while you give a speech? First song I learned on banjo. <laughs> it's not easy being green. Anyway. Superfly My Sky's about, Rizzo. Ooh. What about uh, Camilla? Camilla? Who's Camilla? Yeah. Apparently she's a chicken. Why would I want to be? You already drew me as Chicken Claire. I have? Yeah, you don't remember. Oh, hold on, hold on. No, you drew it. You drew me as Chicken Claire, and I'm gonna prove it. Hold on, I'm I'm not letting that slide. Okay, well, what about this one? This one's a turkey. I haven't drawn Claire as a turkey. That is true, but shouldn't you say that for Thanksgiving? I could. You ever seen the image with the turkey and someone shoved a uh, octopus or a squid inside of that? That's disgusting. Imagine how slimy that is. No, I'm, I'd rather not. I'm gonna go ahead and delete that yeah, from my I memory now. And it's like mucus kind of slime too. Yeah, hold on. I found it. Found it. Hold on. Hold on. I'm saving that image. All right. All right. And I'm know what the image is. But you said you didn't remember drawing me as a chicken girl. Yeah, well, I suddenly did. I say things a lot. There you go. I just sent it. Don't 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 be mean like that. Oh, well, it's okay. I'm not gonna look at it. Why, are you, Hannah? Why are you so mean to me all the time? I'm never mean to you. 
Anyway. Night, Hu Tao. Don't keep don't bother Zhong Li. Silence after that joke. <laughs> Raven, that was lame, and so are you. Aww. I mean, they don't really have a whole lot of female characters that I remember very well from the Muppets. But then again, it's like you. And, and that's Lark the thing; most of them were guys, if I remember. Yeah, I mean, then again, it's like you and Lark probably watched the Muppets far more than I did. The only thing I ever had that had to do with the Muppets was like uh, the Muppets. What was it? Muppets Theater. That was the only thing we had that had to do with the Muppets. And like right now, they have the Muppet, like the original Muppet show on Disney Plus right now. That and the newer one. So, I tried to watch the original one. I had a hard time getting into it. Probably because like there's a lot of stuff they have in there where like kind of goes over my head because it's from the 70s. Oh, yeah. Whoa! That bot that was kicking my butt just left! And I was killed by a minion. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Lame. Hannah being mad disrespectful over here. <laughs> Han Hannah's mean to me. I am not mean to you. You you are so mean to me. There is nothing I could do to, like, hurt you. Because, like, you're bigger than me, you're definitely stronger than me. You probably have definitely have more of an advantage than I do. I mean, probably the only thing I've ever done is, like, probably quote-unquote hurt you is probably see you the PMR and egg sandwich. You ain't that, though. I think he only took, like, one bite, though. Whoa! The light pair! I wish I could light parry. Not me, she's just Hannah. See, Micah gets it. Get a drink. That's such Wait, a good pirate execution. Perfect. Oh, you see that, um. The drink Sparkling Ice released a new type of drink, Starburst. Starburst? Starburst, yes. I tried the... I, I actually grabbed lemon thinking it was orange, I took a sip of it, and I hated it. And I looked like, oh, it's lemon. But I'm trying the strawberry one right now, and it is pretty good. Pretty good. And best of all, it's zero sugar, and there's, of course, no carbs. So, uh, go. I think it's pretty good, it's pretty good. Definitely a little too sweet, you probably wouldn't want to drink it if you're eating something with it. Oh, I died. Dang it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Like, oh my gosh. Oh no. Like, oh my god, dying is like so lame. Oh, that is so last year. Like, now it's all about that reincarnation. I feel Did cringe Betty? just talking like that. <laughs> Did you see Betty? She tried to come back, like, last month. But her card came back in decline. Can you believe that? How? I thought he. Oh, I didn't think that would work. That's such a good execution. Sword 
Good parry. Oh man, I'm doing the long execution. Hold out! Hold out! Come on! Yes! Yes! Do they have a set to where, like, now no one can interrupt anyone's execution? Or is it just certain executions? Um. Uh, oh, uh, you can inter executions can still be interrupted unless you have Hitakiri's feet or you have revenge. Ah. That was gorgeous. That was gorgeous. That was gorgeous. I must go celebrate in another place, not this place. <laughs> this place is full of heretics. <laughs> I died. Hannah, can you make Conan the Barbarian? Can I make Conan the Barbarian? Uh, no. I mean, <laughs> are, are we, am, I, am I drawing Claire as Conan the Barbarian? That would be interesting. How would you do I that? I don't think, well, first of all, I don't think it would fly because Conan doesn't wear a shirt. I, I'm sorry I asked you if you were Russian, Master Sergeant, just like... You said it's five a.m. where it's five a.m. where you are, and I'm like, where is that? You captured zone A. Raven, I have a problem. It's three oh nine in the UK. I'm sat at my desk writing page eight hundred forty one of my story. Now I enjoy writing, but I also enjoy sleep more. Do I need therapy? No. Yeah, dude. If you need, like, you are under no obligation to stay up super late. You know. Thank you. Can I do a dragon clear? That has already been. Thank you, Shaman. Come here. Come here, Shaman. I'm going to teach you for what you just did. Now you think about it. 500 is Greece. Oh, Greek? Oh, you're a, you're, you're a Greco. That's cool. Have the urge for land there we go had to really push that one that was rough that I am close enough on the Christian sect part oh cool cool okay so I know I've got watchers in the UK and Germany and Greece I think I've got one in India a few in the Philippines uh, so a few Central and South Americans, for sure. I know I had one in Brazil at one point. That's yeah, I got a lot of foreign fans, which is awesome. I'm glad for it. I don't think I have any Chinese fans yet. Are you... You know, you could... Um, okay. Well, over in China, aren't they limited to how much internet they can take in? That is true. Well, what about Korea? Do I have any fans in Korea? I don't know. I am good content awaits. My bed does too, but that can wait riding the death of my second villain character. Oh, cool. Pretty really cool, man. <laughs> you probably don't have Chinese fans because they probably blacklist you from their version of YouTube. <laughs> probably. The Raven community is hella diverse. I love it. I actually had one fan who was female and from uh, France, which was cool. So that was pretty diverse. But then she unsubscribed because she saw my Dove commercial response video and said I was fat phobic. And I said, I'm not afraid of fat people. I just think they're unhealthy. We are unhealthy. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's a pro it's a major problem. We're we're trying to fix it. Kim Jong Un is a big Raven fan, dude. Kim, you watching me right now, bro? Dude, I love I'd love you more if you fed your people, bro. <laughs> Don't send me any money. You send that money to your people, okay? <laughs> Kim, they need it more than I do, and I need it. This, Wait, Raven, you're in SC right now. Yeah, yeah, I live in South Carolina. I'm a South Kakalaki boy. Now, I tell you what, we talk real strange down here. I try to talk more normal for y'all people that don't know us Southerners, but you, you come down to the South, boy, you, you hear us talk all kinds of crazy, especially if you go down to Florida. Man, they talk like, they talk like real shit is down there. I think it's all that gator meat they eat. Drives them loco. That Spanish lingo right there. I don't, I don't speak no Spanish. I don't speak no Spanish. I speak Spanglish, which is basically a combination of the two languages. That's rare stuff right there. You get that down here in the South. You don't get it up north where Yankee land over there. You don't get none of that. They don't talk like that. Oh, they, they, the, only, the only language they speak up in the Yankee land is non-sweetener. And I say that because they don't got that sweet tea up in Yankee land. Well, they call it sweet tea. That's what they call it. That, I don't call it sweet tea. I call it sweetener <laughs> shit. Because what it is is it's water that someone took a shit in and decided to put sweetener in and said, there you go, that's tea. And I said, that, no, sir, that ain't tea. That ain't tea. I don't know what you did, but you shat in some water, pulled, stirred it out, and put some sweetener in it, and you tried to tell me that sweet tea? No, sir, you be sued for even adds, calling it that. It adds flavor, Raven. <laughs> you call that flavor? You call that flavor? We call it, what else are we supposed to do? We need to, we need to spice things up somehow with our um, lives. Okay, no, do please only talk like that from now on. <laughs> <laughs> People apparently like my southern accent. I, I was raised on a southern accent, but my parents told me that it's better to speak more normal around folks. Me and so me and Lark try to control our accents. Um, wait, wait, but like, by whose definition would it be normal though? Um, common society, I guess. <laughs> well, common society be damned. All right, we're entering the last few matches of the night. Let's go. Yeah, da, 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 da. You have anyone you want to see, Hannah? Me? Oh, boy. We, already did, we, we can't be someone we've already done. It's got to be another person. Okay. Hmm. Go with one of the Wulins. You haven't done a Wulin all night. You know, that is true. I have not. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How about... How about Puka? Nusha? Okay. Puka. Nusha it is. All right, anyway. Puka. Anyway, uh... I know you like sweet tea, but can, but can you drink unsweetened tea? Because Canada doesn't even serve black iced tea. There's lemon ness, which is like brisk. No, unsweetened tea is um, just dirty water. Yeah, it's not that good. Um, you want to have like a fruit taste. Which it. region like, are you in? Charlotte area, Charleston, Walhalla? Um, I live close to Myrtle Beach. I'm not in Myrtle Beach, but I live... Actually, to be perfectly honest, I live real close to the border between South Carolina and Georgia. We, I'm actually real close to Savannah, about a 45-minute drive from Savannah, Georgia. I live in a town called Bluffton, South Carolina, which is right on the border of Beaufort. So it's real down in the southern tip of South Carolina, like right down near the bottom. Hey, Raven, can you say well done to my mom who has been sober since eight years ago today on my dad's birthday? Very eventful day. Very eventful day. She loves your Legend series and her favorite character to play is Ruth. Your mom plays for honor. That's pretty cool. Well, well done on being sober for eight years. That ain't an easy thing to do. I know people who, who couldn't even dream of doing it for eight minutes, let alone eight years, so that is pretty awesome. Yeah, that's definitely a big piece. Ah, God damn it. My grandfather lives near Bluffton. That's pretty cool, man. Sugar makes you fat, and drinking black tea has helped with my weight loss, but I'd be lying if I said I didn't miss it at restaurants. Um, no, I mean, sugar can make you fat if you don't work it, off, work it off, and I try to work it off as best I can. Raven Knight is the craziest man in the world. Nah, nah, see there, that, that's where you're wrong. I'm not the craziest man in the world. There's someone else who already beat me to the punch on that one. Let me tell you, let me tell you something. I met this guy one time. Boy was crazier than a hen. All right, this, this boy right here, this boy right here. I tell you no lie. You believe me, right? You, I tell you no lie. So I was at work one day, and I was and I was working real late. It was a real late evening. This guy comes in with his girlfriend, and he says, we'd like a table for two. And I said, all right, sir, you come on in. I'll lead you right this way. So I took him back to his table. 
He looks me dead in the eye and says, I don't want that table. I said, well, why, sir? And he said, I want that table over there. I take a look, and it's this table over by, by, by the back window. And I said, I mean, why do you want that table, sir? Like, it ain't no different from this table. He said, it's by the window. I said, all right, all right, it's your call. So I take him over to that back window. I sit him down, and he says, you know, he looks me down in the eye. I'll tell you what. He, he says, uh, do you, like, what kind of things do you serve here? Now, I work at a Longhorns. We serve meat, all right? We serve steak, chicken, salmon, what, what, what we got. Now, we're good at our steak, okay? I'll be, I'll be behind a steak restaurant. So I said, well, we got steak, we got meat, we got chicken, we got salmon, we got some really good. He said, do you have a vegan menu? I looked dead in the eye and I said, sir, what was that you just said? I'm sorry, I must have gone deaf. He said, do you have a vegan menu? I'm vegan. And I said, sir, with all due respect, you walked into a steakhouse and you don't eat meat. He said, well, do you or don't you? And I said, sir, give me a second. I'll get you a vegan menu. I walked to the back and I tell the manager, Joe Don. Joe Don, because that's the name of our manager. Joe Don. He said, what is it, boy? I said, Joe Don, do we have a vegan menu? He said, Raven, what are you on? I said, I don't do drugs, Joe Don. Do we have a vegan menu? He said, you must be on something asking that question. I said, it wasn't me who wants to know. It's a guess. And, I, and he says, tell that guess he's high as shit. So I walked back out and I said, all right, sir. My, my manager says you must be high. And he said, I'm not high. It's medical marijuana. And I said, sir, that still means you're high. And he said, he said, no, it don't. If it's medical, that means it's legal. I said, sir, it may be legal. But it ain't mean you're not high. And besides, you can't smoke medical marijuana in South Kakalaki. He said, I can't. Yeah. And I said, no, you can't. He said, well, I said, you could get arrested for doing that. He said, they can't arrest me. I got second commandment rights. <laughs> I said, you mean second amendment rights? He said, whatever one it is. I hear they changing laws all the time now. I said, second amendment means you can carry a gun. He said, I don't carry none of them neither. I said, good God, man, are you stupid? Where are you from? He said, California. I said, well, that explained it. Um, that <laughs> nah, that's crazy. Yeah, crazy's right. No, Greg was just trying to get on the table. <laughs> All right, I'll stop with my southern accent. <laughs> I don't think I'm annoying people. Believe it or not, I'm exaggerating it a little bit. My southern actually doesn't sound that crazy. No. Like yeah, actually, true story, Foghorn Leghorn is my dad's favorite Looney Tune. Like, I, he loves Bugs Bunny, don't get me wrong, but he said Foghorn Leghorn was his favorite. Wait, which one is that? Uh, he's the rooster. Boy, I said boy. You got, listen to me when I'm talking to you, boy. You're a good kid, but you're about as sharp as a bowling ball, and you're twice as dense. I'm trying to help you. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> I can see your dad saying that stuff, too. He, could, he would. <laughs> I'm going to bed now. Have a good night, Raven and Hannah. I love talking to you guys. Hey, Aiden, don't be a stranger. Come back anytime. We'll probably be streaming again tomorrow night. I don't know what we'll be playing. It might be For Honor. It might be Batman. I don't know. We'll have to see. It won't be Persona because I don't want to play Persona without my brother here. It's a tradition that we play together. <laughs> anyway. There, there. It's okay. Everyone, who's your favorite Looney Tune? Oh, for me, it's Bugs Bunny. You can't beat Bugs. But if I had to pick someone other than Bugs, because that's the easy one. Um... Ooh, that, it is tough. I probably would have to say for me, it might maybe be easy, but I'm not a huge fan of Looney Tunes, and the reason I say that before anyone decides to jump down my throat, so when I was a kid, Cartoon Network decided to do a Looney Tunes marathon for three days straight in the summer. After that is rough. That, after that, I couldn't stand Looney Tunes. And the type of, like, some of the episodes they played that I just did not feel comfortable with, I feel like a mad fight. I did not care for those at all. So, it probably would be, if I had to get Tidy Sweetie or Roadrunner. Roadrunner's pretty out there, man. Roadrunner's pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. Meet me. You know, I gotta give the, the voice actor for Roadrunner credit. It must have been hard memorizing all those lines. Oh, yeah, definitely. You know, he, he did his best, though. Raven turns out my Hispasian is a fan, too. Her brother likes me. Thank God calls himself an inventor. His tech worries me. Sadly, everything he's made actually works. 
Uh, I may sound stupid. What's a Hispasian? Or Hispasian? I, I don't know what that means. You'll need to clarify. Ravenette, my favorite quote from Leghorn is probably the most apt thing you could say to somebody complaining about their lack of skill in their game. You know the one? Which one is that? My favorite is Daffy Duck. Da Daffy's pretty solid, bro. He gets shit on, but... I think it's like a mix between Hispanic and Asian, maybe? Hispanic, Asian? Oh, like half Hispanic, half Asian? Like Filipino? Because I feel like that's the closest you're going to get to a half Hispanic, half Asian. <laughs> Japanese and Spanish? Japanese. Really? They're Japanese and Spanish? That's pretty cool. I love this Berserker. Instead of focusing on me, he runs into my Caltrops. Imagine like they probably have like tan skin and have those Asian eyes. I'd actually be pretty cool to see. Uh, well, you know, Turtle is Filipino. She is? You didn't know Turtle was Filipino? I mean... She's from the Philippines. I mean, either like she told me I forgot, or, or like I just never paid attention. Yeah, and she's coming to visit next month. Oh, well, I guess tell her I said hi. Yeah, I'll let her know. We're gonna spend a few days together. We're gonna hang out. Who's Turtle? Oh, Turtle is a different Hannah. Hannah Valdiabella. She's the one who made the Monster Club visual novel game. Um. She's a really ta she was a really talented artist. She kind of gave up on art. Um, she's focusing more on interior decoration and stuff now. That's her job. Which is sad that we'll never get a Monster Club sequel. <laughs> but, you know, it was a lot of funny. Is she a ninja? No, she is a sweetheart of a girl who's gone through a really rough patch in life. We call her Turtle because she's a little shy. And she is very shy. And we also call her turtle to tell her apart from the other Hannah when talking in conversations. This is true, I'm not a turtle. When she runs out of English insult, she goes to Spanish, and then I can't even understand what she's saying. Hurts more when I don't know what she's saying. Ah, okay. So she's Leonardo. That would probably make her smile if I told her that y'all called her Leonardo. <laughs> yeah, Come here, come get me, minions. Come get me, minions. Die in the spikes. Raven, what are your thoughts on Gaius? Yeah, he's a good character. I like Gaius. He's cool. Who's Gaius? He's one of my characters. Uh, my legend, my centurion legend. He was okay. he, he was a centurion who felt betrayed by his. Uh, Master, so he ended up uh, joining Horkos. Uh, okay, I gotcha. Thank you, Medjai. Are you happy I'm playing Puka, Hannah? Yeah. Raven, have you watched the Conan the Barbarian movies? I have. I have watched them. The best one is the one with James Earl Jones. Yeah. Well, the first one is. The second one doesn't have him. Yeah, I know. Ah, uh, but man, it's like, I still love the... The... The speech of... The Your thoughts? Movie. They're they're corny and silly, but they're entertaining. They're better than Ator. They're better than Ator the Flying Eagle. Oh, that... That's, that movie was ridiculous. And you know that they got inspiration from Conan to do them. Wait, what? Ator Fighting Eagle? Oh, it's so bad. Those are such bad movies. Okay. Are you getting tired, Hannah? No, no, not really. You sound tired. I'm not tired. I wonder where Aaron went. I mean, he may have went to sleep. It's a little early for him to go to sleep, but then again, it's Aaron. You never know. This is true. Who's Ator? Ator Fighting Eagle was this really campy movie that they made back in the day. It's pretty silly. How silly are we talking? It, the graphics are goofy. The fighting is silly. It's really, it's really silly. Like, is it so silly like the um, soap opera Indian? 
Don't it's silly enough that Rift Tracks rift it. Okay. That's how I watched it the first time because Rift Tracks rift it. But then again, like they rift like even good movies too as well, right? Yeah, they rift good movies. Yeah. What do I think of Garrus's character from Mass Effect? He's pretty cool. No, we're um, we're a grunt team right here. All right. Well, we probably have time for one last match. One oh last match. And for to, and oh si since it's the last one, and I made her video today, I think we should do our last match as Theodora. Audible gasp. Yeah, I released your video today, so might as well. Hooray! Did you see that video, Hannah? No, because I don't remember which one she is. Uh, she's one of the warden builds. She's my crusader warden. Oh, then yeah, no. You're so mean. I'm not mean. I had things to do today. Uh, okay. Like play Genshin Impact? I played a little bit of that. <laughs> I had stuff to do. The thing I hate about Genshin is the fact that, like, oh, this domain is open for the stuff you need, but it won't be here. The Wait, next is that? Oh, it's Samurai Hunter! Dude, what is up? Playing Iran, I see. Looks like Nathan did manage to get into the match. And as death! What the heck? Getting people I know. Nice. This will be a fun last match of the evening. Then after that, I may need to head to Betty Bye. I'm getting kind of tired. No, oh, are you getting tired there, huh? Hmm, sounds like a queer talk. How you doing, Nathan? Hello. When you said Ezda, I thought you were talking about a common good kill for a second. No, name of the player. Ooh. Stop yawning! I'm tired. Stop, stop, stop blaming me for it. I blame you. For everything. Yes. Because I can. Because I'm younger. And a woman. That too. <laughs> but most because, because I'm young and short. Does his invention catch your interest at all? Not really. <laughs> I read all that. Um, I, it doesn't really interest me. I recommend reading the original Robert E. Howard books of Conan the Barbarian when I have time. I know those books. Raven, do you want to rapier here to be an outlander knight? No. I don't really want a rapier hero. I don't even know how that would work. Oh, okay. Centurion's gonna lead the charge? Alright, Centurion, you lead the charge. Yeah, I always fight against bots on Breach at the la on, as the last matches. It just adds on to me. It's like, wow, that guy went down pretty quickly. <laughs> and it's like, oh, that's right. He's, he's fighting against bots. Yep. I try to I try to make the last match of the night um, uh, Breach versus bots. Yeah, I mean, it seems more, it seems like pretty a, a relaxing way to do What a good warden execution. Yeah. 
Do you like that execution, Hannah? So how are you enjoying joining me on For Honor, Hannah? Oh, yeah, it's nice. Nice, like, talking during the For Honor stream, learning things here, and, like, talking to the people in chat, like, as well, and seeing if they have any questions for me. Hey, we've had a few for you. Oh, yeah. I'm surprised that I didn't get bombarded with the player uh, picture questions. You know? Yeah, you didn't get a lot of Claire questions tonight. I'm a little surprised by that. Yeah, no, usually they're like, hey, can you draw Claire with this? Like, I don't know. Or they ask if you enjoy drawing Claire and stuff like mm -hmm. that. Yeah. But no one had any questions about Claire. I guess Claire's not as popular as we thought. I guess so. I guess I'll have to stop drawing Claire then. You'll just have to, you'll just, or maybe they just need to see more Claire in order to really appreciate her. I guess. I mean, we've been drawing a shit ton of them now. I guess I have to do more. I guess. Well, to be fair, to be fair, like, you know. No, I don't know. <laughs> okay, DKG just asked, who is your favorite Claire? Asking me or you. What? Asking me or you. You. Me? Yeah. Couldn't be. Which one? Um, no, I said couldn't. You're, you know, it's like, who stole the cookie from the cookie jar? Who, me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. Then who? No, Hannah, answer the question. <laughs> okay. Um. Let me think. Um. I guess right now it'd probably be Alligator Claire. Which Claire? Alligator Claire. Alligator Claire? Yeah. That was a cute one. Uh, yeah, that's pretty cute. And uh, Mal asked, do you enjoy drawing Claire? A lot of times, but sometimes it's not that it's interesting, but it takes longer for me to draw her out. Um... Because it's like my kind of motivation for it just isn't fair. Like yeah, she she's got to be motivated to work on Claire. Like right now, she's drawing a new Claire image, and, and she had to take like a break from it to draw two other pictures. <laughs> she is not motivated. <laughs> well, no, I mean I, I was able to step her out, and I'm doing like going back in there and like tweaking it up and so on. So I think it's turning out pretty good. I mean, I showed you guys the design before Lark left. That is true. Darn right it is. Who is your least favorite, Claire? Any of them that are using the old style. <laughs> you don't like the old versions? I don't care. I do not like looking at my old art. It, it makes, it just, I hate it. Have you drawn Claire as every For Honor hero, or just Raven's mains? You've only drawn Claire as Nobushi, I think. Yeah, I think even that makes me cringe. You might need to redo it. Or you could draw Claire as Puka. This is true. I mean, technically I have done that. That is true, it's an animated adventure. Well, then maybe you need to draw Claire as Peacekeeper. She is your baby, this after is, all. This is true. And you're like, I don't want to, though. <laughs> what do you do? What would you do it for me? What would I get on? Um, what would you want? <gasps> I can have whatever I want. I'm asking what you'd want. I'll decide later if it's what I'm some if it's something I'm willing to give. Okay. Well, I'll message you after. Well, I just enjoy whenever you draw anything from the list, so I'm willing to, like, I'd be happy for anything. Negotiate. Yeah. Anything? Uh, hey, Hannah, I just wanted to say you made my night a hell of a L. A lot of fun. Hell of fun. Okay, I was like, how did you make okay. it a L? That's like, that's it's like, I don't think I understand this English, and I'm an American. Uh, we should all make our own animated adventures. Uh, I don't know if we could do that. 
We need to get back into that. We do. I need to get back to work on that. Yeah, are you the artist who draws the are you the artist who draws the chibi ravens? Yes, she is. Yes. Jay is not good at the chibi. He has admitted that. Uh, the fun the stuff he does. It's like, when you show me those work, I get a sudden hint of envy that hits me. And it's like, I have to, I have to suddenly accept that it's like, this is good. Ray, this is for you both. If you're a fan of anime mythology, I recommend Record of Ragnarok. Yeah, I've seen it. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I have no interest in it. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's certain shows, like, um, some people thought I would be into Persona. I'm not. It's like, it just doesn't appeal to me. Although you do like, um, you do like some of the characters. Oh, yeah, like Futaba. Oh, yeah, she's my girl. I feel like Futaba's just you as an anime character. She is me. Ravenette, how does Hannah draw her art? Very carefully. I use, um, of course I have a tablet, um, I do my work digitally and I use a program, uh, Paint Tool Spy. I, I need to actually force myself to learn to use Quip Paint Studio. Um, I know I did try some time ago, but it was so hard to get used to the brushes and the uh, pressure sensitivity. But it's one of those things where it's like I kind of have to force myself to learn. Um, because Clip uh, Paint Studio has a lot of cool aspects and it is stuff to it. Adel is asking if you um, respect, like if you. Adel is asking if you accept his request. Uh, he's he's saying he wants you to do uh, Red Sonia, Claire. Who's Red Sonia? Female Conan the Barbarian. Oh, is that a character? Yeah, look her up. You'll see. Oh, uh, okay. All right. Do I need to put on uh, Google Safety? Nah, you probably don't. <laughs> I'm like, looking it up. It's like, ah! Oh. I mean... I guess. I would have to be put on the list. I like how you're just like, I guess, which is code for, no way on your fucking life. <laughs> no, I mean, it's... I mean, I have no problem with it. The, uh... Design is pretty. <laughs> I have to show you pictures. Design is pretty interesting. I mean, I have no issue with it. Well, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I can just the but let it, let us know in chat if you want to see more player images from Hannah. Yeah. <laughs> Hannah's like, please don't. <laughs> Well, I'm not. I'm not asking what they want from Claire. I'm just asking if they want to see more of Claire. Uh, I'm already putting Muffet. Please do. Yep, we got one. Please do. Because because y'all y'all got to motivate Hannah now. Y'all got to motivate her. Because remember, if she's not motivated, she won't do it. Oh, I mean, for stuff, I think we've kind of already done a mermaid. I wouldn't mind Valley Girl Claire. No, Valley Girl Claire was oh, hilarious. Okay. Yeah, I, I like Valley Girl Claire. That one was funny. I did not ask. I said, do you want it to end? Not really. Okay, making sure, because if you were getting tired of it, you know, that, that was something to keep in mind. 
Nah, I mean, as far as, I think the only time I ever get tired of it is, like, if I just wanted to break it because I wanted to work on my own. So. Raven, I what's your favorite anime or show in general? Um, One Piece is my favorite anime. My favorite show? I'm not, I'm not sure. It used, to, it used to be Arrow before they decided to mess all up. Nah, Arrow wasn't even my favorite when I liked it. Um, really? I thought you liked it. I did like it. I just, it just wasn't my favorite. Mm -hmm. Um, It's hard to say. There are lots of cartoon shows I liked growing up. Like Ed and Eddie? No, I wasn't a big fan of Ed and Eddie. Uh, Teen Titans was cool. Justice League was cool. Which version? Um, Unlimited, I think. I think that's the one that I probably watched. Am I a fan of Boba Tea? Actually, no. I've never cared for Boba Tea. We win! Hooray! I like you, I love Ed and Eddie. I'm glad you do, I just didn't care for it. How dare you. Alright! We did a... Uh... Guys, I'm, I'm making my way up there. I've almost gotten uh, Warden up to Rep 47. We're going to get Warden to Rep 80 in no time. Oh. How dare you not like Boba? Oh, I, I just... I, I just did. don't like Boba tea. No. I've tried it. Raven, you I don't like Ed, Ed, and Eddie? No, I didn't really care for it. The art style wasn't my thing. The, Eddie himself was pretty was pretty cringe sounding, like his voice grated on me. Um, I just didn't care. Everyone looked ugly. Like I'll be honest, like everyone looked very unappealing. Like there were some funny moments. Like I remember Ed being like funny sounding, like the dumb one. Like that he was. Some of the things he said made me laugh, but that was the only thing I remember liking. Like. Just him and be, him being stupid. And if the only thing you can like about a show is someone being stupid, do you really like the show? That's kind of like if someone said, oh, I love SpongeBob, but it's only because Patrick Starr is an idiot. You know, like, then you don't really love SpongeBob because not every episode of SpongeBob involves Patrick, you know? Um, yeah. And that was the thing. Like, Ed, Ed, and Eddie just didn't appeal to me. I mean, I, I don't mind people liking it. I don't, I'm not saying it's a bad show. I'm just saying I didn't like it. It wasn't, it wasn't a show I got into. It just wasn't your cup of tea. Yeah, like I just, I just didn't like it. Mm. What about Batman Beyond? That one was pretty cool. I just didn't watch as much of it. Um, I, I preferred the animated series personally. But it is animated. Oh, Atla can go crazy all he wants. He's not doing a thing to me. I fear not the Atla. Anyway, uh, Atlas upset that I don't like Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Um, oh, I mean, he's not for everyone. Well, anyway, ugh, I'm tired, guys. I need to go. Um, but it was fun. Uh, what are my thoughts on Baldur's Gate? Cool game. Not enough hours in the day to play it. Um, I enjoy it. I haven't played it. Yeah, I mean, it's, 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 in, it's enjoyable. But anyway, uh, thank you guys so much. Um, we're probably going to call it there. Thank you, Hannah, for joining me. Hopefully we'll be able to do this again sometime soon. I do yeah. not know what I will play tomorrow night. We may do For Honor again and make it a For Honor weekend to celebrate the uh, loot fest that's going on. Or I may play Batman and just wrap up Batman Arkham City. Or I'll just skip ahead to Origins. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of sick of City now because <laughs> I've done everything. Um, but anyway, or or... Or I may just do Valkyria Chronicles or One Piece Odyssey just to F with you people. Um, no, play Genshin. Just play Genshin. Play Genshin. Uh, play we'll, Genshin. S we'll see. We'll see. Some night I will just stream Genshin. It's going to happen. Um, all right. Well, thank you guys so much. Dang, I didn't realize Front servers were still active. Dude, they've been active for... We're on year eight, bro. We're having a great time. But anyway, thank you guys so much. As always, uh, great doing this for you guys. You guys make this possible. And as always... 
I will see you in my next in my next video. Whew, take care.